All right, as of right now, if you open up Rust, you're going to get an error message, and it's failed to in initialize player. Um, this is because of reshade. Reshade is now bannable, and it, they detect it now, and this is because of January 13th. Um, they finally started actually putting this on everybody's updates, whoever is using reshade. You won't get banned for using it. If you uninstall now, you won't get banned. If you open Rust now, you won't get banned, but you just won't even be able to open up Rust. So I'm just show you how to uninstall it and some alternatives. And there is a bypass right now. I could show the bypass when I get to 2000 subscribers. I've already found the bypass for it to just remove the, the initialized player. So 2000 subscribers and I'll show that, but let's just get straight into it. So, um, what you're going to do is just go to reshade here and you're going to click download. I'll put this in the description. You're going to do download reshade 6.3.3, download the latest version. Now it's right here. Okay. Now I'm just going to drag it over real quick, right over here on my desktop. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to close my rust, make sure rust is closed and, um, I'm going to go back to my desktop and I'm going to open up or wherever you find it and I'm going to open it up. Now this is what you're going to see. You're going to see all your games. Now if you have two Rust clients and two Rusts, that means you have a backup of your Rusts in all your games. So on my computer I don't, but if you have two Rusts, just click on it and check the file path and if it says backup then that's the wrong one. Choose the one that says no backup or something similar to mine. Now just click Rust client and press next. And then do Microsoft Direct X 10, 11, 12 and uninstall reshade in effects and press next and there you go that's it now afterwards you're going to go to rust because if you open it um it still won't work and you're going to go to properties okay and you're going to go installed files you're going to find rust right click properties install files and verify the game files are in installed correctly verify integrity of files you click that and you just let it verify and once you're done verifying your files, it should take a while, it should say verified, and you can just press play. Click on yes. Uh, launch your game, and there should be no error message. And there we go, I'm in Rust for now. No more reshade. All right, and that'll be it for the video. Now, there's a lot of alternatives, um, like your physical monitor, better G, uh, better, better um, vibrance, um, Nvidia, AMD filters, stuff like that, but the reshade is probably my favorite and there is a bypass right now um at 2000 subscribers i'll show the bypass it isn't too hard it ain't bannable it ain't trackable um because all they're doing is tracking if you could even load up rust with reshade i don't actually track if you're playing with it because they don't think you're playing with it so 2000 subscribers i'll show how to do it um and yeah i hope you guys have a good day bye, -bye.